In this video, I'm gonna show you the three second way to remove horrible decals and stickers from car glass. Now after any given detail, if you're detailing an old 4Runner like this, oftentimes, especially when they're getting ready to sell like this car, you've got decals or stickers that have been on here for literally like years. This is my client's son's car. So this is a decal from when he was in college and going in and out of a parking garage and all that sort of stuff. If you don't have the right products, this is a nightmare. If you have the right products, it is unbelievably quick. The very first thing that I wanna do is just blow it off. And all that's gonna do is take all the debris and, and blow it off really quick. I just want as clean of a surface to work with as possible. Next thing I wanna show you guys is that I can use either a razor blade that's metal or a razor blade that's plastic to try to get this done. The great thing about glass like this is that I can use the razor blade that is metal and because the glass is harder than the metal razor blade, it's not going to scratch anything. This is the easiest way to get under a decal and what you're gonna find is that when you start to try to pull it off, inevitably I'm gonna go as slow as I can and I'm not coming at it like this, kind of back and forth, trying to push it up. I'm just working my way kind of into it and around it, around the edges. Like I said, if I angle the razor blade properly, this is not going to cut anything into the glass. Once I get a little lip up, I'm gonna try to pull as much of it off as will come off. You guys might notice that I'm not wearing gloves. The reason I don't wear gloves when I'm doing a detail like this is because if you've ever tried to pull tape off or something sticky with gloves, you know that it's kind of a nightmare. Now the next thing I wanna point out here is what just happened is exactly what I can expect to happen. I'm never gonna get an old sticker like this off in one fell swoop. I'm gonna have to come back in, it's gonna tear a little bit, and I'm just gonna take it kind of piece by piece, just like this, with my metal razor blade. Now that the sticker is totally off, I wanna show you guys, number one, that there's no scratches. Number two, you've got all this terrible sticky adhesive on the glass, and this is, once again, if you don't have the exact right product, this becomes a nightmare. I wanna show you how simple this can be, but this is not going to come off with car soap, dish soap, it's not gonna come off with any like all-purpose cleaner, it does have to be a specific adhesive remover. Now this is where I am pulling out the rapid remover adhesive remover. I keep it in a gallon jug like this. I'm gonna tilt it over like I would a little alcohol bottle. All I'm gonna do is rub it onto the surface and let it sit for just a second. I wanna show you how simple this product is to use. After it's sat for maybe 15 seconds, I'm gonna come in with my towel and I'm gonna wipe just like this. Barely any elbow grease at all. A little bit more in certain areas if I have to, but this product pulls off adhesive like you would not believe. I'm gonna rub it all the way around here. Then I'm gonna come in with my dry side of my towel, mop it up off the window, it pulls off super easily, and I'm gonna follow up with my Optimum No Rinse, just like this to remove any and all residue. Grab my other microfiber towel just like this, wipe it off of the window, clean it up with my dry side, and now I'm gonna get a super clear way of seeing if there's anything left over. And assuming there is anything left over whatsoever, you can see a little bit of traces right here. I can take my razor blade, scrape it off the surface just like that, go over any of these areas, potentially right here as well. Anywhere I see any trace, I call it shadowing. If a sticker's been there long enough, the adhesive almost like etches into the glass. So I'm just taking my razor blade just like this, scraping the whole thing. It's a great way to clean glass. And you can see now all that's gone. I'm gonna take a little bit more Optimum No take my microfiber towel, wipe all of it off, and you guys can see the simple after result. Absolutely nothing there. Blow it off, and the sticker's completely gone. Glass is totally ready to be dressed or shined, and we are good to go. And there is zero reason to make it any more complicated than that. I use the air compressor, two microfiber towels, optimum no rinse, my rapid remover, and a metal razor blade to remove things like this. The plastic razor blade is generally what I reserve if something's actually on the paint because the metal will obviously scratch into the clear coat. On glass, a razor blade is one of the best ways to do it. It's also a great way to clean glass. If I've got some surface level water spots or other things that I just can't get off with chemical, I often take my my razor blade and I'll scrape the glass up and down until I basically shave all of the gritty pieces off the glass entirely. I'll link all this stuff up in the YouTube description box below and if you want a full list of tools and products I suggest for pros, check out the pro detailing toolbox below this video. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Remember, a great detailer is always learning and from Luke here at Wilson Auto Detailing, I'll see you in the next video.